Hello everyone, and welcome to the Returner's Hideout. I'm slightly amiss. A new channel name for a new set of Let's Plays. Uh, I'll get more into that in a minute, but first I want to give a shout out to my friends at County Line Gaming. Um, you guys are the best. All of you. Uh, Corey, Don, Katie, Steve, Sarah, Zach. All you guys. Kyle, of course. I can't forget Ricky. You guys are the best. Countylinegaming.com. Um, we are going to be starting this new channel off with a let's play of one of my very favorite original Mega Man games. I'm sure you all know what it is by now because you've read the title. It's Mega Man 2. Perfect. This is a, an NES game, as I'm sure you all know. Um, I usually start off with Metal Man. That seems to be, like, the standard. Um... Where, you know, it's been so long since I played this. I'd say maybe, when was the last time I played through this? Like, 2009 or something? Yeah, something like that. By the way, um, now, and this might be giving away too much information here, but it is immensely difficult to play this game, um, while receiving, well, you know. It's hard to play when you're doing that, that's all I'm saying. So, <laughs> my recommendation would be, just play it when you're not doing that. Like, don't don't try to combine play with play. It doesn't it doesn't work. I mean, unless you're really good. I mean, you're really fucking good at this game, you know. I could see that happening now. I could do, like you know practice. Yeah, that'd be fun. I love the music in this game as well. Very very good. Now, you can be very easily killed by those drills, um, so my recommendation would be to not die from them. But they will drop power-ups. I, I missed the extra guy up there. Should I go back and get it? Should I go back and try to get it? Should I... No. See, that was dumb. That was dumb, viewers. You saw that coming. Let's see if I can get an extra guy. I call them extra guys and not extra lives or one-ups or whatever. Extra guys. Extra guy, main guy. Main guy, that's that's what I always, like, everybody calls them bosses now. I always call them the main guy, which I guess is really the same thing. Is the main guy the boss? Pretty much. Villains getting so much respect even in the 80s. Well, I, I mean, I wasn't primarily alive during the era. Apple was. I don't know, maybe we could ask him. Uh, wasn't really the 80s, like, the era of the villain? I don't know. I wasn't around then. Well, very briefly. For approximately 27 days? Yeah, I was alive for 27 days in the 80s. Am I giving away too much information here? Am I giving away too much? God damn it, I did it again. The fuck? <sighs> Cyclical dying. As the gears turn away. I like Metal Man stage a lot because, like, <sighs> Metal Man, Metal Man as a main guy is interesting to me because, well, for several reasons, really, is his attack patterns are unique. We'll get into that once we venture further into his lair. <sighs> Metal Man is the guy who keeps the shit running, you know what I mean? Like, he's down in the bowels of the factory, or whatever the fuck, wherever we are. The power facility, or something. There's just a bunch of gears going, there's a bunch of shit going on here. And Metal Man's like, he's down here, like, he's down here keeping the cogs running, you know? He just wants to be in his little lair with his little spring buddies. He doesn't, he's, he doesn't care, he, he, you know, he's, he'll put the big Dr. Wily sign, like, ahead of his lair, but pff, he just wants to hang, look at it, he's just hanging out. Alright, now, so we've entered his domain, and he won't attack us unless we shoot him. He'll just stand there, look at him. Well, okay, he gets a little pissed if you don't shoot at him, but then he jumps away from you. He doesn't want anything to do with us, he just wants us to leave. I can respect that. 
Metal Man, you son of a bitch. And, you know, actually, I maybe that's a little harsh. Metal Man probably was the son of a bitch. Metal Man's mom was probably a fucking bitch. See, but now he's shooting saws at us, though, and we can't... We, we don't tolerate that as Mega Man. Alright, motherfucker. Look at this, I'm like getting all into this. No, cunt! Metal Man, done! <sighs> but who's gonna keep the cogs running now? See, we- I don't know, that might have been bad. Metal Blade, as anybody who has played this game knows, is a broken weapon. It kicks ass. I mean, which doesn't necessarily mean that it's broken, but is that to then therefore suggest that broken things kick the most ass? I don't know, that's an interesting question. Um, now, I kind of forget the weakness of the people in this game. I think Woodman is weak against Metal Man. But I'm not sure. But we're gonna move on to Bubble Man, because I know for sure Bubble Man, you can kick his ass. So that's where we're going. <sighs> Bubble Man to me was always the least interesting of the Robot Masters, which is what they are called. They are indeed called the Robot Masters. I don't know what to make of Bubble Man, you know? See, like, with Metal Man, he has this whole, he has this whole lore going on for himself, you know? Like, you, they don't even, pff, I don't even know what's in the manual. I don't remember the manual for this game. I should go download it. Maybe there's some backstory. But... Just from the details of Metal Man's... Be careful when you jump here, if you're playing along at home. Uh, because you jump really high in the water, which makes sense. Somewhat, I suppose. I don't know, I, I mean, I used to swim a lot when I was a kid. Um, so it's been a while, but I certainly remember a more fluid type of motion in the water than, say, otherwise. That's a shitload of energy. That was bad, viewers. That was bad. It took me right out of my song and everything. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Got some shrimps going on here. But yeah, as I was saying, Metal Man has, like, his own thing going on, you know. And so, although, some of the other Robot Masters kind of do, too. We'll get into that once we visit their stages. I don't want to I don't want to preempt anything here. <laughs> <laughs> That's just not my style. Uh, yeah, I think I've I've finally snapped viewers. I think this is what has happened. But I'm glad we're on this new channel now because it just makes more sense. And I think this is also like the third, or will potentially be the third time. I don't I don't know for sure yet. See, here's where they they really try to mess with you because they don't want you to win. They want you to lose. Well, they just want it to be challenging, I think, is really the case. I don't think the designers of Mega Man were really like, let's put the spurs to these bastards. You know? Like, that's a thing nowadays. They were like, let's make the hardest game in the world. Yeah. And that's not appealing to me. Games have to be fun. Otherwise, it's, um, you know, I don't, I don't know. It's, it's, <sighs> here's the thing. Now, I, I can appreciate the people who, who genuinely have fun playing challenging games, but to the people who are like, I'm gonna do this because I'm a bad at, that's a dick measuring contest. I don't get into dick measuring contests myself. Um, no. There is primarily a reason for that, but let's not, let's not get into that, viewers. 
<laughs> uh, not not during the Let's Play. Maybe, talk to me some other time. See, Bubble Man, he's just a... I think Bubble Man's probably just like a pederast. I mean, look at him. He's shooting bubbles out of his ass. He's got this weird, like, pellet launcher. He's just a weirdo. Yeah, we... See, we took care of him. He's, an, he's a non-main guy. He's like the jokiest main guy of them all. He does have a rather large fishnet behind his stage as well. I wonder what that's all about. I don't know. Bubble lead. Because that makes complete sense. Um, shit, I don't know. Should we keep going? I don't know. Yeah, let's fucking fight Airman. See, Airman is... Airman. Airman is kind of a... He's he's kind of a beast. I mean, he's a he's probably a jackass, but... He, he fucking lives in the clouds. What do you want? He has the right to be a jackass. Everybody hates Airman, but I don't hate him. I really like him and his stage music. And I shouldn't do that. <laughs> That's probably annoying. <laughs> So, why Returner's Hideout? Well, because Final Fantasy 3, or 6, whatever, if you're a noob. Not if you're a noob. If you're if you're accurate and precise, and you like to call the Final Fantasies by what their names are, the real names, then I can appreciate that. But I was a kid who had a Super Nintendo, and I call it Final Fantasy 3. But you can call it 6. That, that really doesn't make you a noob. That's just me talking shit. You know, it's not serious. In fact, I have referred to Final Fantasy 3 as Final Fantasy 6 many, many times. So, I'm with you, I'm with you. But, Final Fantasy 3, right, Returner's Hideout, and yeah, Locke, I wouldn't necessarily say he's an idol of mine. I, I wouldn't aspire to be Locke Cole, but he's a good character, I like him a lot. What's Locke? I and mean, we're getting off into a tangent here. When I should be talking about Airman and how he's a badass, but we'll talk about Airman once we reach Airman. If Airman can be reached, that's a good question. Anyways, Returners Hideout, because I fucking love the Returners, number one, that's a good name. It's better than Avalanche. The thing with Avalanche that it- god damn it. The thing with Avalanche that I didn't like is that it was in all caps. It was like, they had to yell their- they had to yell their name at you. They couldn't just... I don't know, say it, you know? See, this is kind of a confusing place to start in, because you're supposed to go to the left, when typically, in a typical Mega Man, you know, fashion... See, you gotta go fast here. Is that the trick? Go! Damn it. They used to be good at this game. Game over. Except... <laughs> This is a home console. <laughs> we can just continue for free. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. <sighs> what the hell was I talking about? Returner, Lock Cole. He's a, he's probably my favorite Final Fantasy character. Um, I know you crazy kids nowadays probably like Final Fantasy... 13 or whatever, and I haven't played Final Fantasy... Well, I played 11 and 14 and 12. So, yeah, I guess I have played Final Fantasy after 10, but 10 was I, probably the last Final Fantasy I sunk a decent amount of time into. And by sunk time, I literally mean I sunk time. That was a complete waste of time. <laughs> but Locke, to me, is... He's, he's almost like an OG Zidane, almost, like... There's very similar characters. I think Zidane is definitely a lock derivative. Um, without question. I mean, without question. But the thing about Zidane is he's... He's kind of like a showboat, you know? Which isn't necessarily bad. Not really a showboat, but I think Zidane... Zidane is in it for some tail, you know? Like, he even has a tail. He's in it for tail so much. But Locke is like... I'm, 
Locke probably gets some tail, don't get me wrong, but he's like, he doesn't care about that, though. He's, he wants to revive his, his woman, you know? He doesn't care about anything else. I mean, he cares, but... I don't know, Locke is like, he's a good character. Zidane is just kind of like a showboating ass, you know? Decent character, though. I don't mind Zidane too much. But I mean, like, look, take a look at Locke. He's like, he doesn't... The world ends, he loses everybody again, and he's like, fuck this! No, I'm getting Phoenix, bitches! I'll revive my bitches! I like that. Okay, alright, this this needs to be coordinated here. We need to get some precise time management. That is bullshit. My playing ability, that is. Not the game itself. I love Mega Man 2. It's fucking amazing. Do 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 I don't know, we got off on Airman, let's talk about Airman. Son of a you fucker. Do 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 I like Airman as a character because he lives in the clouds. His weapon is tornadoes. He's clearly... He's clearly a very angry person. I'm angry... Yeah, angry. But, you know... Airman's probably been through some shit, you know? He... There we go. See, I'm giving some props to Airman, and now it's letting me pass. Airman... Airman is a is a soul to be defeated, but he's also a soul to be respected. And he has some cheap, cheap ass patterns as well. Watch those eggs. And if you're fearing feeling rather very bold, uh, you can go ahead and fertilize them as well. What the hell are we talking about now? See where did this go? So we're in the clouds, bitches. We can talk about whatever we want. Alright, Airman. Do we have a tank? We don't have a tank. Fuck that. Alright, should we... Airman. He will push you away. He... Look at him. He is pissed. Okay, watch those tornadoes. They fucking take damage. But the thing about Airman is, like, he dies easily. Look at that. He's... He's a pushover, but he's fucking a beast. Look at that. No, I like Airman because he lives in the clouds. He's he's also on the top, middle, bracket-wise. You know, you got the three brackets: the bubble, air, and then whatever metal man. You know. Whoa, what's going on? Message from Dr. Light. Item 2. Complete. Tid. Get your weapons ready. Dr. Light looks entirely too pleased to be handing weapons over to us. I will say that. Get equipped with item 2. See, like, defeating Airman is a moment to be savored. Quick Man is on top? Well, okay, let's see who's on the bottom. Metal Man, mind in the bowels of the cogs, right? Flash Man, I don't know what his deal is. Crash Man is obviously on the bottom, he crashed. Wood Man, mm, Wood Man on equal footing with Mega Man is in the middle as well as Dr. Wily. So, Wood Man, Wood Man is on equal footing with Mega Man, and so is Heat Man. Heat, Wood, Bubble Man, he, he's out there, so obviously he's on top. Air Man, obviously in the clouds. Quick Man, I don't know what his story is. We'll have to get to that. Who are we going to fight? Wood Man? Right, let's fight Wood Man. Roar! Wood Man. 
Woodman lives among the monkeys. That's fair to say, right? I think there's even monkeys in this stage, isn't there? Do 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 do. Rabbit, <laughs> don't shoot your carrots at me, <laughs> please. Do 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 do. That's so appropriate. That's so appropriate, Mega Man 2, to nature, because of rabbits and yeah, you get the idea. Whoa! Someone let the dogs loose. And they are not happy. I like Woodman's stage music as well. <laughs> A girl once told me that this was her favorite Mega Man 2 theme song. Woodman, of course, naturally, yes. I understand. It is a catchy tune, though. I think a lot of people would probably say Crash Man or Flash Man, probably, as their favorite. Me, Metal Man, and Air Man. And I think it's just probably the opposites. Metal Man as a stage music, and I suppose as a character as well. Um, yeah, I knew there was fucking monkeys in this stage. Rawr! I'm a monkey! <laughs> Oh, this is fun. We do 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 fucking monkey. I hate monkeys, you guys. They're creepy. I'm sorry, monkeys and gorillas are creepy. I, I think specifically because they're proto humans. And that's just weird. Don't shoot your carrot! Haha, ha, I dodged your carrot. Bastard. Hop, 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 hoppity, 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 hop. Hop, 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 shoot in. That carrot went straight up in the air. That's bullshit. <laughs> or an ama- God damn it. Or an amazing skill. I wish my carrot would go sh- Okay, I kinda walked right into that. God, no, no. No, the, the, it's broken. There, there we go. My carrot's broken. Wait. <sighs> I think we have. An, <laughs> I think we have an episode title of yours. <laughs> I want to get killed before I get there. <laughs> I stand corrected. Woodman is made of wood. I think four Robot Masters is probably good for a video. Die! I cannot see myself! That's bullshit! <sighs> Alright. Try this again. We're gonna have to face the monkeys again. But we can do it. Do do do. Am I making you uncomfortable yet, viewers? No. And see, nobody's gonna nobody's gonna sub to this new channel. I can tell. It's it's gonna be too much. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. My favorite stage theme is Woodman. How apropos to you. Apropos is kind of just a douchebag way to say appropriate, by the way. I don't like being a douchebag though, because <laughs> I don't like. I mean, someone can clean up for me after I'm finished, but for me to clean up after someone else, I don't. I don't, I don't like that, you know? I don't I don't know if I could do that. I don't know if I would consent to that. We could deconstruct some words while we're playing here, because we've seen this before. Like, we got some monkeys coming up, and then there's some peacocks, and... or something like that, I don't know. Monkey. Do 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 
do do do do do. I don't know about these birds, like... <laughs> it's like, here, I don't want them. <laughs> you take them. <laughs> That's hilarious. Do 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 Yes, I laugh at my own jokes. I'm self-assured that way. Nah, I'm not really self -assured. Whoa! This, this, uh, controller's a little weird. Now, well, I, I have to agree, Miss, this controller is a little weird. <laughs> Get it? Yeah, that's bad. No, I'm using the Garvis Gamepad Pro. So, I don't know if you want to look that. It's like, it's kind of wonky, though. That's cool, though. Um, we'll use it. Do 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 See, Woodman. Woodman is dead this time. Oh shit, I'm gonna die! Oh, what? That was close, though. I almost died again. Wow! Look at how much... Or rather, look at the lack of ammunition that that took. Get equipped with Leaf Shield. The game orders us to do so, so who are we to argue? We'll see you next time on Let's Play Mega Man 2.